G'day, this is Jonah from Cars Guide down here in, at Sandown Racecourse on a very brisk Melbourne afternoon. Uh, we're here to do a stunt driving course held by Driver Dynamics. Alongside me is our lucky competition winner, Liz. How are you feeling about today? Oh, a bit excited about it. You ready to go? Oh yeah, I think I'll have a great time. Okay, let's do it. G'day, I'm Kevin Flynn from Driver Dynamics. I've been working as an advanced driver trainer now for around about 21 years. Uh, commenced Driver Dynamics about eight years ago. As far as we're aware, and we've researched it as much as we possibly can, uh, there's no other driving school on the planet that will allow you to do a ramp to ramp jump. The most critical thing with the jump is the speed. So um, just as we get to the ramp, or just as the car gets on the ramp, I'll say to you, get your foot off the gas. Okay, so you take your foot off the accelerator. Often Guys, in particular, uh, like to give it a little bit more throttle as we're going up the ramp just to make sure that we clear the ramp and all that sort of thing. We know the right speed and everything. We know you'll clear the ramp. If you give it that little bit of extra, uh, then we'll nose dive into the dirt. We're going to practice our speed as we're going down. So When you get to about 33, 34, change it in the third and then settle it down. Be smooth, be acceleration. Keep it at that, keep it at that. Keep it at your speed, 41. Yep. <laughs> The second thing we'll do uh, is a 360 degree spins on what's correctly called a split surface. Now uh, what we have is wet vinyl which is very very slippery and wet bitumen which isn't quite as slippery uh, and we get you to come down into this exercise at 60 kilometres an hour and hit the brakes as hard as you possibly can. The left hand front wheel of the car will automatically or naturally turn off the vinyl. <coughs> uh, whilst that's happening, your right hand rear wheel will slide onto the vinyl. Okay? Uh, then your left hand rear wheel will leave the vinyl as your left hand front wheel comes onto the vinyl. You see how it works? Yeah, it's a vicious cycle. Hold 60, don't go any faster. Just hold 60, hold 60, clutch. Hit the brakes, hard as you are a stunt driver. <laughs> <laughs> Any of you guys used hydraulic handbrakes before? Okay, they're not like a normal handbrake, um, whereas you have to hold the pressure on yourself. It doesn't go click, click, click. We come down, we'll give you the signal, and the sequence is clutch, okay? Pull the handbrake up first. Okay, then a third of a turn with the steering wheel to the right, okay? And just as the car's coming to a stop, hit the brakes and the reason why we hit the brakes is to stop the car from rolling backwards and to prevent the car from going past 180 degrees it just makes it neater. Now watch your speed we come right up to the 40 pretty quick now maintain it right now put one hand down on the handbrake now all right keep your speed at 40 keep it going 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 clutch handbrake hard as you can put on the brake from the stunt driving experience, basically all people are going to take away from that is a bit of fun and excitement. Um, we call it uh, bungee jumping for cars because basically it's just an experience. Um, they may pick up a small uh, indication of basic vehicle dynamics, but that's basically it. I think the jump was probably the best. Um, I think also driving on the two wheels was really cool. <laughs> it's nice. <laughs> cool. I had you know, some expectation about how it would go, but it was really good fun. Yeah, really enjoyed it. Well, that was just awesome. I'm still buzzing from that jump. Do you reckon you'll be able to pull off a few of those moves in the supermarket car oh, park? Oh, look, it might get me into a car parking spot. I don't know if I'll get out of it, though. <laughs> this has been Jonah from Cars Guide and Liz. Until next time.